Hey guys, welcome back to Bambi TV. Guys, we'll be reacting to Walk Influencer accidentally creates epic Trump campaign ad. Guys, let's get straight into this. And here are the first 15 promises he has made if he is re-elected. You may have heard of Project 2025, but this is from Agenda 47. And you can read all of these on his website. First, he promises that he will carry out the largest domestic deportation operation in history. Get out! He will also ask for the death sentence for anyone convicted of human trafficking. He will close the Department of Education and return all education standards to the states to decide. He will put prayer back into school and he will criminalize any race-based advantage programs. He will end the Affordable Care Act. He will ban gender-affirming care for adults and children, and he will ban any federal dollars from going towards gender-affirming care, which means anyone with government-provided health care will no longer be able to access gender-affirming care except for Viagra and Cialis. Those will still be available. Yeah, boy. <laughs> he will propose a constitutional amendment that gives a term limit to Congress. He will deploy the Department of Justice to investigate the Biden crime family and any of his adversaries or political rivals. Let's go, Brandon. I agree. <laughs> He will immediately pardon all of the January 6thers, and he will create a task force to investigate anyone who arrested, charged, or imprisoned a January 6er. He will increase the penalties for underage criminal offenders, strengthen immunity for police officers, and deploy the National Guard to patrol woke cities. On day one, he will reassess our participation in NATO and says that every European country needs to pay the United States for protection. He will also restore the wonderful travel ban for Muslims coming to America. He will build freedom cities. This is 10 new cities built on federal land. He will award them to areas with the best development proposals, and he will prioritize moving young families to these freedom cities. You son of a bitch! I mean! He will kill all e-vehicles and e-vehicle legislation, seeking to replace that with the development of a flying car. He believes that we could create a car that vertically takes off. He will remove all of the limits on American natural gas exports and drill baby drill for oil domestically. He will impose a tariff of up to 60% on Chinese imports. He will extend the 2017 tax cuts and drop the corporate tax rate from 21% to 15%. He will push Congress to pass legislation that would give every American the right to concealed carry anywhere at any time. And he will revoke any gun restrictions or legislation that seeks to inhibit people's ability to own guns that's been passed in the last several years. He will demand that Europe pay back all the money we gave Ukraine, and then he will use all of that money to recruit for the American military. And he will take billions and billions of dollars from private university endowments by taxing, fining, and suing the universities. He specifically names Harvard in this one. <laughs> and then he will use that money to create the American Academy. It is a free online college that will be free of wokeness that he will force employers to recognize as a bachelor's degree equivalent. So that's Agenda 47. Cool. Guys, this is actually amazing. But like, I, I don't agree with everything. Like, tell me what you don't agree with. Well, personally, I don't agree with every single thing she said. But like, if you think about it, I'm happy he's going to change the the trans community like i'm happy he's gonna put like a limit to it because to be honest it's supposed to be stopped and i won't say stop i will say stop because i i really don't want to sound like cruel or anything but like i feel it's supposed to be stopped i feel some people really don't know what they are doing i feel some people want to feel among and that's it they feel they'll be accepted being a transgender but like most of them does not work. Like, I think you should go to a church, go to a community, chat online, like, make friends with people who's going to make you feel comfortable. No, you change your whole gender to actually feel that way. Like, it does not make sense. And I think Donald Trump is on that. He speaks his mind. And sometimes, like, I love the way he talks. Well, like, he talks so much for a president, but, like, I love the way he talks. And I love the way he's open-minded. And I love the way he does not give a fuck. Like, he, he just said, as it does. And this is why I really want him to come back. Like, I love doing talk. To be honest, I love him. He's an amazing person. He's very intelligent. Like, listen to him talk. And sometimes he says something, but like, he's intelligent. We must say. But I think what you think about this, like, share, subscribe to my channel. I'll see you next time, guys. Best.